Hey, welcome back to Camping and Coffee. I'm glad you stopped by. This is gonna be the crappy video. Yes, it's gonna be one crappy video. And the reason I say that is because, that's right, I'm gonna be testing some RV marine grade toilet paper, also some septic ready toilet paper, and some regular toilet paper. It's gonna be one ply, double ply, triple ply. That's right, triple ply. So we're gonna check it all out. And but I don't don't leave yet because I know there are other videos out there. But I have learned. I watched a few of those. I kind of tweaked them just a little bit of what I'm gonna do. And that is, I want to agitate a little bit more because I noticed that none of the other ones really agitated. They didn't really do a lot. Like they were, you know, like if we're moving, if you you're out dispersed camping, you're camping at a site that doesn't have facilities, you don't have time to dump. We're going down the road. That stuff's sloshing around. We're gonna find out. Does it actually break it down? Will it break it down more? The other thing is I'm gonna use our happy camper, our odor eliminator stuff that we put down in there because it says on the side that it helps eliminate and break down the waste. So maybe that helps break down the toilet paper as well. I wanna find out. So I'm gonna do eight of them in regular water and then I'm also gonna do eight with a little bit of the happy camper in there. We're gonna do the agitation. We're gonna find out and I will show you the results each day. I'm thinking about doing it for about seven days just because sometimes you might do an extended stay. We'll find out at you know day three and four and five all the way up through seven. So we'll go there. So I appreciate you once again stopping by, hang with me, and let's find out the results. Wait, 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 stop, 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 stop. This is Future Rob. I want to let you know I know the results of this experiment. However, I want you to know that this is not only an RV dissolving, or not an RV dissolving, an RV toilet paper dissolving experiment, but it's also, we, I did a blind test with the family members to find out what they thought was the softest toilet paper, and then also what is the, uh, the most durable toilet paper. So stick around to the very end. You're gonna wanna know that as well. Let's get back to the experiment. All right, Johnny, let's show them who we've got here. Let's start with, we've got Volterra. I actually never heard of this, this company. We got Camposoft, Scott Rapid Dissolve, Camco RV Marine and Toilet Tissue, Scott 1000, Ultra Strong Great Value Brand, Quilted Northern, and Members Mark Premium Bath Tissue. From here over are Septic Safe. These four, from here to the left, they are actually RV grade toilet paper. So I'm gonna fill them up, and I'm gonna start this process, and we will check back in a little bit later. Okay, we are all loaded up, we are ready to go, and we're gonna, now we just wait. We're gonna wait each day, I'm gonna come down, we'll do a little agitating, and uh, we'll check it out, and I'll let you know. See you tomorrow. All right, so day one here, I wanna take a look at them. This is before I agitate. So here's the very first, the Volterra. These are camper ones, camper soft. Nothing really looks, uh, I see some of them have sank, some of them are still floating, which is interesting. You know, like the Scott's Rapid Dissolve, still hanging out, like nothing looks real crazy that I'm noticing. Same thing, RV Marine, Scott's 1000. Still hanging out. But if you do notice, you notice the color difference between the water? So the one that I put the, uh, the Happy Camper in definitely looks a little yellower. So we'll see what happens with that. Here's the uh, great value. Nothing, nothing looks real crazy. Same thing here, Quilted Northern. And then the Members Mark. So everybody looks about the same at day one, but here, I'll, let me, Let's do some agitation. All right, so after a quick, let's just say a little quick ride there, uh, nothing, I, I noticed nothing really with some of these. So the uh, Volterra, other with Campus Soft, uh, the Scott's Rapid Dissolve, there, the RV Marine, nothing in uh, really there, but however, Scott's 1000 here. If you look at that, there's pieces, there's pieces that are starting to break, break apart in this one. I, there you go, look, like down here in the bottom. That's actually starting to break apart. When I started to shake it, it was coming apart. So that is a little bit interesting. 
the uh, nothing with the ultra premium there the great value nothing with the quilt I, I take that back quilted northern here uh, this one in the front with the water it had just a little bit some of it there was some little bitty pieces in here that were starting which that really surprises me but nothing back here just just a little bit like if there's a piece you see it down at the bottom down there we'll see so it'll be interesting to see what happens this is just day one so we'll find out what happens but yeah here nothing with the members mark as well but yeah the uh the scott's 1000 now i do have to say scott's 1000 was probably the uh the least of my favorites i mean it feels good here, here hold on now i do have to say from a feel standpoint the members mark actually feels best the quilter northern is actually uh not it's probably the probably the softest of them uh, and then it gets down like the, that's for the septic ones and then you get down to the uh, the rv versions surprisingly the camp is soft that's a really soft feeling toilet paper i was surprised um but you know, oh, hold on just a second I got just bear with me just kidding so we're gonna do a quick flyby stop if anything looks like it which there is the Scots is definitely starting to dissolve. The uh, the previous one, the campus, the campus soft was starting to, but you'll notice here comes another Scots. It's starting to dissolve pretty good. Ultra premium, not really doing a whole lot. Quilted Northern, it's kind of doing a little bit, it looks like. And then the members mark is starting just slightly. So after the agitation there, um, the Valterra is not really doing a whole lot. Camposoft, if you take a look at the edges, you'll see they're starting to look a little, little frayed down in there. It's starting to show some signs. Scott's, I mean, gosh, both of them. You can see Scott's is starting to fall apart really easy. That's the, that's the rapid dissolve. The RV Marine toilet tissue is starting to show some signs. The uh, Scott's 1000, once again, dude, I mean, totally, you know, totally, totally gone. Uh, the next one, the surprising one, the Great Value Premium Ultra Strong. It is starting to break apart pretty good in there. That was after a little bit of agitation there, second day's worth. And then the other one that, like I said, it's starting, starting to is the, the Quilted Northern. This is like triple ply. Triple ply. And, and it's starting to show some signs. I mean, it's still holding together, but at least it's, it is starting to break apart. And then the other one that's surprising me, good old members mark. Uh, it is starting to break apart down in there as well. I mean, you can really kind of see it here in the, the Happy Camper version. So surprise, surprise, we got some interesting things taking place. We will check back here in just a little bit. Here's the quick overview of day three. And right now it looks like, so the Valterra, nothing really looks changed. Uh, nothing really looks changed here with Camposoft. Scott's rapid dissolving, obviously it's doing its thing. Uh, the RV Marine toilet tissue does look like maybe it's starting to change a little bit. Scott's 1000, obviously it's falling apart. This one looks very similar, but this is, like I said, the Great Value Premium Ultra Strong. It's definitely changing a little bit. The Quilted Northern, eh, it kind of looks like the way it did yesterday. And then the Members Mark, uh, it still looks kind of like yesterday, uh, but I don't know. So, all right, let's, let's do a little, little agitating. All right, another quick look here after the agitation. Still nothing, and, and I think this is the one we've actually been using in the camper. But still, it's it's dang near, still, everything still looks intact. I mean, look at all those. I don't think they've changed a bit. Yeah, that's crazy. Campusoft, it's still, even back here, it's still, I mean, you can, it started looking like it was going to change, but now it, man, it still looks about the same as well. 
Obviously, Scott, Scott's is now even more gone. I mean, that stuff, yeah, it's just turning into liquid. The RV Marine, same thing. It's starting to dissolve, although, I mean, it's not dissolving as fast. Here's the Scott's 1000. It's basically completely broken down. The Ultra Strong, this is what I was talking about. Take a look at that in there. Man, it is, I can't believe how much it's broken down as well. Here you go, that's a little bit better shot. Look at that. Crazy, crazy I say. The Quilted Northern, starting to break down, but mm, still kind of solid. I mean, you can see some pieces down in there starting to break apart, but still, I mean, it's pretty good for just regular old septic safe uh, toilet tissue. And then here's the uh, Members Mark bath tissue, and it's starting to break down pretty good. If you look inside that, same thing here. Maybe I can, I don't know if you can see down in here. Here's a little bit better shot for you maybe. But yeah, so it's starting to do its thing as well. We will check back tomorrow. All right, just kind of a quick peek here from start to finish day four. And then kind of looking about the same. Yeah, Scott's 1000 there, we just passed. Here's the uh, Premium Ultra Strong. Definitely looks like it's definitely breaking down a little more. Yeah. Even here in the Quilted Northern, starting to. And then the Members Mark. Yeah, it's breaking down more too. Let's agitate. All right, so even after that agitation there, still this Volterra, 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 whatever it's called, it has not changed. Literally one bit. It has not disintegrated in four days. The uh, Campus Soft here has changed. I can see it's starting to change, but not, not as much as I would think. Then, you know, the Scots, I mean, it's all shaken up. It was all settled out down at the bottom, both of the Scots, uh, but it, it's, I mean, it's still doing its thing. The RV Marine toilet tissue. This one, it's funny, the one with the water is breaking down. It looks like more than the one with the Campus Soft in it. Or excuse me, happy camper. And Scott's pretty typical. The uh, the Ultra, the Great Value Ultra, is definitely, definitely breaking down. I mean, I don't know if you can. Here you go. Might be a little better view. Maybe I'll do that really quick here. Same thing. Quilted Northern definitely starting to break down uh, a little bit more. And then the uh, the members mark. Definitely breaking down. So here are a quick overview, day five of the toilet papers and nothing has really changed. I mean, you can see they're kind of all kind of, well, not all of them are breaking down, but the ones that have been breaking down. Once again, this great, great value. I'm, I'm shocked about that one. The Quilted Northern, same kind of thing. You can look, it's breaking down. The same thing with the members mark. I'm, I'm really shocked. The only one that hasn't is <laughs> surprisingly one of them that is actually supposedly an RV one is that Volterra. So do not buy Volterra. I can tell you that. But all the rest of them are actually doing some kind of a breakdown. So let's agitate just a little bit. I do have to say the Scott's rapid dissolving RV and boats. I mean, that's the, I mean if you're fine with one ply, and uh, you know, not worried about uh, maybe feel or durability, then I'm telling you, Scott's 1000 uh, or the, uh, the rapid dissolving one, that, that's the way to go for you, but not for me. Uh, I do not say that's for me. I mean, that stuff is just, there's nothing left. That's crazy. That was five pieces of toilet paper and there's nothing really left in there. Like I said, same thing over here. It has really, I can't believe how much it's dissolved. 
Same thing though with the RV and Marine. Like I said, a lot of them are starting to break down. Now it's been in here for day five, but yeah, those two, but I mean, like I said, that's the one ply. They would not be my TP of choice. Here we go, day six. Woohoo! Starting from the beginning. You probably almost know the order by now. And it's Volterra, Campus Soft, Scott's Rapid Dissolving, RV Marine and Toilet Tissue, Scott's 1000, Great Value, Premium Ultra Strong, Quilted Northern with the Triple Ply. Triple Ply. And then, last but not least, the Members Mark. So most of them, most of them all kind of look about the same. I mean, you can definitely tell they are breaking down now. I mean, day six, things are breaking down all except the Volterra. Once again, I can't believe it. Crazy. RV Marine tanks for clog free, it says, yet none of it has broken down. Do not buy that stuff. I mentioned it before. I mentioned it again. All right, let's do some agitation. Yeah, so here after the agitation, they all, except for the very first one, as mentioned, they all actually look pretty good, even after that. I mean, you can look down in there. Any of them. I mean, they're, they're basically broken down. So, I mean, we'll wrap this up tomorrow. Go over the, re the final results. But, yeah, these are all completely broken down. And here we are at day seven. Yes, finally day seven. Let's go through them here real quick before we do the last agitation. So, Volterra. At the beginning, here you got Campus Soft, Scott Rapid Dissolving, RV and Marine Toilet Tissue, Scott 1000, Great Value Ultra Strong, Quilted Northern Ultra Plush, and Members Mark Ultra Premium. Let's agitate. So here we go, lids off. I said Volterra just so you can see here at the end the last I'm like seriously look at it it did not break down either one of that's crazy campus Soft broke down pretty good and the color discoloration is from you know from if you remember at the beginning there I did put the happy camper in there just to see if anything looks different so here we go, Scott, rapid dissolving. I mean, definitely, definitely dissolved. But the RV Marine and toilet tissue, uh, it did a pretty good job too. I mean, that's, that's broken down pretty good. Scott 1000, now we're getting into the septic safe. Look at that stuff, oh my gosh. That is crazy, 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 crazy. Great value, ultra strong. Same thing, I mean, it definitely broke down. Quilted Northern, ultra plush, here we go. Look at that, crazy, huh? And then good old members mark, broken down, broken down. Now let's go into our final words. Welcome back to the future. Yes, experiment is over. It's now time to talk about softness. So this might surprise, this actually surprised me just a little bit, but uh, we did a blind test between the four family members. I took them up, I kept them in the order. So I, I mean, I know which one, but I still voted on my favorite. But anyway, uh, let me show you, this This really shocked me here just a little bit as to which one that uh, the family members thought was the softest. So first, two of them were really close and two of the other ones. So I'm gonna show you four. The first one on the list, Camposoft. Camposoft actually is a very soft uh, toilet paper. Really, 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 really surprised there. I mean, it, it felt good. Uh, the next one that, uh, which should feel soft, was the, uh, the Ultra Quilted Northern Ultra Plush. It should feel soft. I mean, my gosh, I think this was the triple ply. Yeah, this was the triple ply. Triple ply. Toilet paper. And for triple ply to dissolve that well, that was amazing, by the way. Next one that uh, folks thought was pretty soft, the Great Value Ultra Strong. That one, uh, that was a good one. And then the last 
Last item that probably shocked me the most, I can't believe I'm saying it, was the Scott Rapid Dissolving. It is very soft. I can't believe it. And it obviously dissolves really, really well and really quick. But uh, yeah, so those, those were the top four soft filling uh, that we all kind of made the top four that we all agreed on. So now from durability, durability on the other hand, different story. So let me, uh, let me show you the contenders here for the durability, which part of them came from the softness family, which uh, let me show you. So durable one. Camposoft again. Camposoft felt uh, pretty durable. It, it seemed like it had a, a good pull test there. Same thing. That's kind of what we used. We did it. Uh, we just kind of did a little pull test and said, hey, which one we thought felt the strongest. No real scientific method there. I didn't hook any weights up to it. That could be a good one to do, but uh, it's just based on feel. The, uh, the other one that felt really strong, Members Mark. Members Mark. It was up there, it was a close runner up also on the softness side, but uh, for durability wise, it seemed like it was pretty durable. And like I said, that's the one we actually use here at the house. So I'm, I'm not surprised by that one. But the, uh, the one of the next strongest that we thought, once again, great value, ultra strong. And it should be strong since it says ultra strong. However, you've seen softness, now you've seen durability. Drum roll please. The favorite out of everything and all of them was Great Value Ultra Strong Back Issue. Yes, folks, that was the winner out of everything from dissolving, softness, durability. That was actually the choice out of all of this. So there you go. There was the RV toilet paper experiment. I'm glad you hung around this long. Thanks for stopping by and we'll see you in the next video. All right, take care. Like I have to say it, it feels good, you know, if you're rubbing that on, your, on yourself, it does feel good, I'm not gonna lie. But it is one ply and uh, you'll be washing your hands a lot. You know what I mean?